What are beautiful people? It is your homegirl, Shameless, all up in sunny California. So this au natural beauty look is brought to you by Beyond the Lights. I was invited to attend the screening with my girl, Linda, and the film is all about natural beauty. And it chronicles the character, Noni, and she's this Beyonce type of super stardom. And she has to deal with the pressures of the media, her mom manager, and everything is just layers upon layers. And she is no longer the artist she started out to be. But throughout the film, she discovers her inner beauty, her inner voice, and allows it to shine through. I can identify with Noni's character as I went through a similar transformation. And that was discovering my inner beauty and by it not being defined by my hair. And it was an extremely vulnerable place for me to be in, letting go of something I identified with for so long. And sometimes it is easier being someone else other than yourself. Sometimes the hardest thing is embracing your own natural beauty. So of course, your homegirl, who's the shameless one, who was always preaching to do you, be you, and stay true, created this unnatural tutorial for you. Now I, I don't, I don't even wear makeup, but there are those times when you want to go on a hot date, when you want to stay tricking, you know, freshen it up a bit. Really? That was like a DJ scratch. <laughs> Anyways. I am going to break down this look for you. It's a hummingbird fight, is what that is. I'm gonna break down this look for you, okay? How to stay tricking, reveal your inner beauty, and how to do you, be you, and stay true. Well, a little bit of mm. You know what I'm saying? A little bit of mm. The first thing I do is make sure my skin is clean and moisturized. I love Pure and Simple. I've used this product for a year now, and it's ideal for my skin. So once that is set, I just use some concealer. Okay, once that's done, I'm going to get a fluffy brush and get some powder. So I'm just getting the product on the brush. Instead of going everywhere, I'm gonna start here, contour, because this powder is darker. It's more of like a bronzing so I'm just going there and I'm blending outwards and even though the concealer is a few shades lighter when you blend it out it's not as dramatic so that's pretty much it for the skin part so now onto the eyes it's kind of shimmery color it's by NYX called Vesper so you just want to take like a lighter color nothing too light compared to your skin tone. It's like a shimmery taupe. I would love to know what your natural beauty means to you. Comment below. Done. Next, I'm gonna kind of carve out my crease. I'll use this brown. Any shadow will do. Just make it a few shades darker. This is Top Notch by NYX. Get in there. Other side. Then I'm gonna take a fluffier brush and blend it out. I'm gonna take this black liner by L'Oreal that I bought in Geneva, Switzerland because I forgot my makeup kit at home and this was so expensive. This was 20 bucks for L'Oreal. You ain't hooking your people up, man. I believe L'Oreal is even made out in France, isn't it? French. So I'm just emphasizing more of the outer corner, kind of like a cat eye, subtle cat eye. Boom. Then I'm going to take this small brush and smudge. Oh, outdoor filmings. This is why people film in their bedrooms. Okay, blend it all out. So it's not a harsh line. Now the eyebrows. You best believe I'm gonna use this L'Oreal brow pencil. It's actually really good. This is the same pencil I bought out in Geneva. So what do you think that cost? $20 as well. Everything was $20 each. So I ended up at the cashier paying $75. Okay. So I'm just gonna start there and feather in. 
I like this pencil because my eyebrows are so greasy and this doesn't move and it's also not harsh, severe looking. Use your favorite mascara, use anyone. But this one is natural. So they say, yeah. <laughs> so they say. And I only do it on the top because if I do it on the bottom, my skin is so greasy that it's gonna just smudge it off. Okay, so I'll just take some powder. Get rid of all the shine. And you know, you know I like a good snatch, so. Three lines. So it's like one, two, one, two. And this is my eyebrow. Fame and GD. So then just get some, some blush, just a little bit. Okay, almost done. Almost there. And then this, some gloss. This is actually really nice. This rose gold from Michelle Phan called Angelic Luster. Let's just use a dab of that. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. High points, high points. That's a look. Bam, done. Getting it. This is something I'd wear to a screening, on a date on a Tinder date. No, I'm done with that. So if you guys are into romance, if you're into discovering inner voice, inner self, inner beauty, the journey of a young woman and the coming of age of her superstardom to what she really wants in life, check out this film, okay? Remember to do you, be you, and stay true. Be shameless, boo.